Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed and doing blessed and highly favorite, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you for the love and support that you give me on the times that I'm here throughout my videos, even when I'm absent, it's greatly appreciated. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while, I have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback or the content of my video or you're up telling me about your empath again if you feel like the video is very informative or it just gave you good vibes and you feel like somebody else needs to hear it at that time please go ahead and share and while you're at it give me a thumbs up or even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit once again thank you for stopping by my channel and I hope you're able to resonate. Today, my video is never, never cut yourself short or dim down for no one. And that's true. I'm going to tell y'all something. I got, I got a little story time today. You know, if there's people who have been with me for a while and, you know, I've been noticing a lot of people going through stuff. It's like right now, a lot of people are showing true faces. There's people that are coming at you because your light is so, shining so bright. And I've been telling people, you know, hey, you know, baby boy, baby girl, you know, let your, you know, your light shine like a diamond. Like Rihanna say, you, you need to, you know, don't ever water yourself down when you're 100 proof. If people can't take that 100 proof, they need to go. You know, that's why I use my, my my channel for my platform you know a, a lot of people have been with me for a while and I love the fact that they've watched me you know through my videos from the empath twin flame INFJs uh, Wiccans pagans uh, white witches uh, twin flames as well as Hayokas. you know a lot of people say that there's not a lot of Hayoka videos out there and I know I you know I usually go variety of different ones but lately universe and sources have me on Hayoka's like right on rice so I get after that and there's a lot of people who keep coming at me telling me or hustling you know people are attacking me you know I mean they there is when they when you're on towards a blessing you on to something good on your right path trust and believe you're gonna go through a lot of stuff that you're not gonna understand you don't understand why people are coming at you this supposed to love and care for you attacking you any way possible because they see something you you obviously don't see in yourself and I've showed a lot of people that you know this is what you are you know I tell people you know they're not sure about their uh, empath gift there's a lot of people that sit up here and told me their situation I always tell them if you're not comfortable enough to put it on you know one of my videos or whatever drop it in a comment I always get a hold of me on you know my email via email or you know Facebook Messenger I always tell people that you know because I, I respect people's confidentiality I don't never share you know whatever they're talking about towards it but I know if I feel a strong feeling about something I'll use it as content but I you know it just like I'm doing right now because there's a lot of people that went through a lot of hell through their spiritual awakening and it's like when you are in that moment of glorifying your freedom glorifying the fact that you know more about yourself because that is a true blessing you know there's people come at me want to you know poke 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 I, number one, I'm going to tell you, I ain't got time. <laughs> I don't have time. You picked the right Hayoka for that. You know, and I, I mean, I, I got to that point. That's the reason why I haven't did too many videos. I've been going through so much release. And I tell y'all, it's been with me for a while. If I feel some type of way or I have that vibe that I'm in rage or something like that, I won't make no videos. I don't, I mean, I don't have, you know, everybody's not going to have a positive day every day. We all go through stuff. And I tell y'all this because that's why I make my videos off of the things that I go through, the things I experience, or things that comes towards me that, you know, Source want me to talk about, you know, Spirit Guides want me to talk about. This is what I'm blessed to do. I'm very humbled to be able to do the things that I do. I never want people to feel sorry for me because there's a lot, of, like I said, there's a lot of people that has watched all my videos but not have watched my intro video. And that's the fact that I love because when you have watched so many videos like dang I can really resonate with this chick I can really you know relate to what she's going through she's actually telling me my life and she doesn't know me you know and then when you finally see my intro video on the reason why I started pushing out these videos it takes people aback like oh my god she's this she's this is that and there are some people that you know I've had people unsubscribe me when they found out you know who I really was who was I related to you know and some people were intimidated about it and some people you know 
love that because of who my father was. And it's just like when I went through a lot of things in my life, it was very painful to go through. You know, still still stuff I'm still healing from. There's days, like I said, I cry. You know, there's a lot of things that my dad's pushing me out to do. Like, I'm getting out of my comfort zone. There's times y'all see me on the intellectual side. Y'all see me on my crying side. Y'all don't see me on the pissed off side. And then y'all see me sing. You know, and there's a lot of people who say, oh, Rosalind, you can sing. And now I start putting out videos with, you know, videos about my dad and backstory and stuff like that. There's wish I, there's more videos I can put out, but just for copyright issues, you know, I can't, you know, put a lot of videos out like that unless it has something to, you know, entitled with me. So I noticed that. So, you know, uh, there's people that, you know, wanted me to do requests for certain songs. And it's just like, I don't want to do them unless I have my dad singing in the background. If it ain't got nothing to do with me, I can't put it on there so that's the sucky part about it and um but it's just what my situation like when you come for me number one i try to tell people this is my my channel you're coming to my house but number one i'm not gonna allow nobody to poke poke at me or try to see how bad they can press their button buttons because i am that right one you know, I can be very classy with it and I can cut it with a knife and I have no problem. But there's people that even came at me a few days ago telling me, F you, I hate you. I had to laugh at something like that. I just instantly blocked them because they want to try to be a-holes. I ain't got time. If I feel somebody's trying to be provocative me, I'm not going to allow you to do that because people love to get up under your skin. Don't allow people to get you out of your character. And it's like I tell people... Or my situation, I use that as a positive platform. Some people, I've tried to help people that people I've even known for years. Like, oh my God, I feel like I'm going crazy. And I can already see what they're going through. They're going through a spiritual awakening. They're, they want to waste money going two and $300 an hour. Go see a therapist when I can simply tell you what's going on for you for free. But if you want to waste that money or if you want to play victim and have people feel sorry for you, you know, I, I've had to delete people off my page because they want to play that victim where they want everybody to feel sorry for them. If you're not trying to correct that, I'm not going to stay in your life and allow you to irritate me because of what you want to go through and you don't want to heal from it. That's all on you. But, I, you know, I tell people I will help you. You know, there's people that found out who I was. They didn't want to, you didn't want to hear that. Or, you know, people try to tell me I'm lying. I said, if you're an empath, you know when people are lying to you. You know when you get fed bullshit you know you know excuse my friends i ain't trying to disrespect nobody but like i said i should be able to talk freely but it's just like when we're going through all these situations and people are judging you or they trying you know when they see you in a good mood people want to bring you out your character or question your existence don't never you know who you are you might not know fully who you are because you're in that process of learning yourself you know and it's crazy how we can be we're us but you can walk around like for years blind in your own truth because you don't know you know you, you react to certain things that average people don't react to a certain way you know what kind of energy people bring towards you but a lot of people don't go through that so it's just like to me what i do is such a blessing to me you know i tell people go watch my intro video and then you'll find out the reason why i do the things that i do but when you come at me when you especially when you do a youtube channel i'll tell anybody who's opening to want to do a YouTube channel, and especially if you're trying to do stuff like I'm doing, you have to have thick skin. Because I don't have people send me death threats because of who my father was. Just because they had enough nerve to open up their own channel about my dad and they didn't get as much view or get played as much as I did just because of the fact that it's who my father is. You know, I don't use that to be like me because I'm Prince's daughter. That's not me. I say, look, this is the situation. My dad had to give me, my mom and my dad had to give me up for adoption. My adopted father and my stepmom used my father for financial gain and still kept me away from my father. That was enough for me to have to deal with knowing my family used me for their automatic ATM just to make their life, you know, they want to keep up with the Joneses and they're still walking around free knowing you know they got information that can help me get home for me to be with my biological family but they played me they're trying to keep their self out of jail keep their self nose clean by making themselves look good that's something you have to deal with so you know if i have to deal with this and this is my family there is nothing somebody can come at me and say to try to pull my strings or trying to come at my my character i'm not gonna allow that you know because i'm 100 proof you know i don't act like i'm the ish but if you want to hit that bitch switch, I can show that. 
<laughs> I can really show that. That's why I tell people, this is the day. So that's why I tell people, when you know your strength and you know your worth and you know, you know, you don't have to have people fear you. My family, they fear me because I know too much. They don't know who I'm telling, what I'm telling it to. But I just don't have time for all that. If you can't accept somebody for who they are, that's why I say, you know, if you don't like me for who I am, unsubscribe me. I don't care. You know, you if you, if you feel like you're going to come out a negative, you better, you know, be very choicy with your words. Because you either I can delete you and block you, or I can make you question your existence just because you had enough nerve to be ballsy and come at me like that. Because I'm that one. Either I make a video about it, or I just... Go ahead, because a lot of people will say stuff on the internet they won't tell you in your face. You know, you have to think about stuff like that. When you come out with channels like this, you have to be able to have that thick skin to know that even though you're pushing out positivity, you're going to get negative BS at times. But then you're going to actually get blessings by knowing you have helped the next person. That's what I love. You know, I take the bitter with the sweet anytime, but, you know, I'm not going to let that pull me out my character. I might say what I got to say and then be done with it. I, I get done because I ain't got time. But it's just like, I know with my situation has helped so many people. That's the blessings that I look out of. To let people know you can go through the hardest things in life because this is what you were dealt with. But you signed that contract many millenniums ago. To know you even picked your family. You picked the people that you are dealing with right at this moment. On that, you know, that last, that last life you had to know that you were about to enter this life and go through some straight hell because you don't went through it so many times in your past lives. You didn't got, you didn't get it corrected. So this is the time you're supposed to cut that generational curse. You're going, you're going to end that karmatic curse that you're going through. So all the stuff that you're going through, you have to go through that right now. So if you know that your light is shining, you feel like you're blessed and you know you're moving towards that positive path. Trust the fact this darkness is going to come for you. Trust the fact that you won't have crazy people coming at you acting stupid. But it's your choice on how you respond to it. So never sit up here and cut yourself short or dim yourself down for no one. But like I said, I'm not using my platform to use me as a product of my situation because I'm not. That's why I'm open and telling y'all what went on for me. I know how, you know, I know I watch too much reality TV to know people will go poking around and try to figure out what they can find out about you because well, I know when all this stuff come out about me, people gonna try to dig, but it's just the fact is, on my channel, I've been so open about it, you can't say nothing about me, I ain't said about myself, so you didn't try to make money off of all what you want to make it off of, but it ain't gonna be nothing, because I already told you, you might just have a picture or something like that, you're like, oh, Rosalind told us about that, you ain't saying nothing you ain't told us about, but anyways, like I'm telling y'all, never dim yourself down, you know you 100% proof, and they can't take you for that, then go, you know, you have to you have to preserve yourself. You know, you have to know your worth. You have to know you have to step into your power and knowing you can do anything that has been thrown at you. That's why I tell people when you try to come at me, there is nothing that you can possibly do to me to puncture me or have me come out my character. There's nothing. Because when you can have family like mine and can do anything like that, and that was enough to break somebody and make them want to off themselves, and I still have not, and I can still find a reason to smile throughout the day and feel grateful for what I'm going through to be able to use what I went through to help the next person. That's the where the blessings come in. So, you know, when you're going through situations like that, knowing there's a reason for it and darkness will come for you, especially when they know you're heading towards something good. So I hope you're able to relate to this and I, you know, I send out many love and blessings. I wasn't trying to, you know, send out no negative energy, but I know a lot of people needed to hear that because you're going through a lot of stuff that you're going through. So, you know, like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell. I hope everybody's staying blessed. And I'm going to go ahead and give a post notification shout out for my next video because this one's already too long. So like and subscribe, hit the notification bell, drop me a line, even share, and I'll see you on my next video. Much love, peace, be wild.